Dimagrod is packaged in 600 milliliter cartridges, two and also five gallon bulk units. It is a high strength, rapid setting, resinous concrete repair material. It's used to fill spalls, cracks, and pinholes prior to the polishing or coating process. When polishing, a pinhole-free surface will produce a higher gloss level. It is a one-to-one -one mixed ratio, which lends itself well to small batches. It is 100% solids, which enables for deeper repairs, and it has an extended working time. So when do you use this material? Well, anytime surface defects will have an impact on the final appearance during the polishing or coating process. Or when quick turnaround time is really critical for a floor repair. With shallow repairs, they can be done without adding any aggregate and deeper repairs by adding an oven dried aggregate, you'll have a successful repair. You want to apply the material prior to the use of the Dimapro 50 grit transitional hybrid tool. Make sure the concrete is completely clean and dry. If you're producing a spall mortar repair, pour equal amounts of A and B into a mixing container. Add oven dried aggregate to obtain the desired consistency. Place the mortar in the repair area and finish with a trowel. For a grout coat, mix equal amounts of A and B in a mixing container, pour the material on the floor. Using a stand-up trowel, work the material into the surface, trying to remove as much excess surface material as possible. Once the material has cured anywhere from 45 to 60 minutes, depending on temperature, continue grinding with the Diamond Pro 50 Grit Transitional Hybrid Tool. Here we are applying the material with a stand-up trowel, forcing the material into the surface as they work from one side to another, trying to minimize the amount of material remaining on the surface. The material comes in various colors. The odor is very slight. The VOC content is zero grams per liter. The pot life is approximately five minutes and 100 gram mass. So what that says is that do not leave it in the container for very long without putting it on the floor. The coverage rate is anywhere from 1,200 to 2,000 square feet per two gallon kit, which equates to 600 to 1,000 square feet per gallon. Compressive strength, 3,900 PSI without aggregate and 4,800 PSI with aggregate. It is a one-to-one -one by volume mix and the shelf life is one year unopened container. The image to the right, you'll see the arrows are showing small little pinholes on the surface. And on the right, there are no pinholes. So the left was uh, left ungrouted and the right was grouted. All materials have limitations with moving joints and cracks, or cracks that have hydrostatic pressure, Dimagrout should not be used. Some solvents and oils might have a slight effect on the appearance, but it's not going to alter the ultimate performance. When repairing a joint shoulder, fill the joint completely, allow it to cure, come back and retain that joint with a saw, cutting completely through the repair and filling that void with the joint fill plus store the material above 45 degrees when using precondition the material prior to use between 75 and 95 degrees once the material is cured grind it from the surface as soon as possible the longer the material is allowed to cure on the slab the more difficult it will be to remove it If you're using two or five gallon bulk units, you'll need the Dima tint to tint the material. With cartridges, the Dima Pro cartridge gun, with bulk material again, 
a mixing paddle and drill, and for application, the stand-up trowel. With all Dymapro chemicals and also equipment, they all have a QR code on the side of the bucket or the machine itself. By scanning that, you'll be brought to the website where all the product information, videos, brochures, and also manuals will be located. Thank you for your time. And if you have any other questions, please contact your Dimapro Systems representative.